Hi, this is Pastor Harley Wheeler with the Broadway United Methodist Church. I want to share with you some verses out of Judges chapter 6. Some of you, if you're going along in the read the Bible through, might be in Judges chapter 6 with me. Uh, God is calling Gideon forth to, to work a salvation, to work a defeat of some Midianites who are oppressing the people of Israel. It's a time of grace for the people, and you know, and the love of God and his power and his, his saving things will be channeled through Gideon. And the God, God says to Gideon, The Lord is with you, O mighty man of valor. And then the Lord says also in verse 14, Go in this might and save Israel from the hand of Midian. Do not I send you. And then the Lord says, I will be with you, and you will strike the Midianites, who were very bad people and doing very bad things, down as one man. And one of the replies that Gideon says is, if, if you, Lord, if I found favor in your eyes, um, don't depart from here until I come to you and bring out a gift. And the Lord says, I will wait until you return. It's rather profound to think that God is ready to send Gideon. God has promised to be with Gideon. God has laid the, the picture out of Israel's salvation to Gideon. And finally, God has to say, well, I will wait. It's an interesting twist in the story when you read it through in chapter 6 of the book of Judges. God is ready with everything. It, is, it could happen right now. And then God must say, well, I guess I will wait. And so many times, um, it strikes me that God has to be satisfied with what he will get from us, uh, good or bad, um, you know, today or tomorrow. Uh, let's not be making God wait. He has wonderful things he wants to do through you today. He has forgiveness, compassion, love, care, help, service that he wants to channel through you today. So let's not, you know, though Gideon turned out all right in the end and worked a great salvation through Israel, let's not begin by making God wait. So you have a blessed day.